All right, so this is a suggestion via a donation. Um, the name of the video is The Joker versus Pennywise. Listen, if you are new here, please like and subscribe. The more that you like this content, the more that I know that you specifically would like to see more of this specific type of content, okay? Let's go ahead and just jump into this immediately. We have the lyrics pulled up just in case we need them. Um, I know they're on the screen, but I generally can recall them better by looking at the monitor to my left here. Um, so don't be surprised if I do this often, all right? All right, let's go ahead and jump into it, guys. Let's check it out. The joke. Cast of Phoenix to blame me. Joaquin Phoenix. I'm the Harlequin of hate. Harlequin. The clown bitch of crime. The Phoenix to blame me. I'm the Harlequin of hate. Thinks a homophone for Harley Quinn, his partner. The clown bitch of crime. Your sewer troll is Stephen King wrote between his lines. <laughs> what? Wrote between his lines. He wrote between his lines. Like lines of. Hold on. It's like cocaine. Oh, okay. Yeah, lines of. Okay. Oh, Stephen King wrote between his lines. <laughs> I think this may right now be the better wrapped one I've heard. Um, one of the better ones, at least. Um, as of right now, no complaints. The beat's dope. It feels uh, somewhat new school. Um, and he's rapping, rapping, guys. Let's get it. Oh, it's like cocaine. I said, I don't know how any kind of joke could ever go over that head. Because his head is huge. Also, at the same time, I think he's referring to the intellect of the, the clown himself. He was a genius, kind of, right? So, maybe a double. Let's get it. Like cocaine, you know what I said. I don't know how any kind of joke could ever go over that head. They all float, says the quote. But your films, they all sink. They all float. They all float. Don't worry, George. You just come down. You'll you'll float too. I think this is the uh, the part of the movie that he's referring to. They all float, but um, all right, let's continue. But go over that head. They all float, says the quote. But your films, they all sink. Oh, and as far as Mr. King goes, I'm a shining man. Shots fired. Shining. Stephen King. I think that was um, Stephen King's story. Uh, Stanley Kubrick um, basically brought it to life in a sense. Um, and um, I think like King absolutely hates the fact that he did that, but yet it's super famous. So I don't know. Um, so I think that's kind of what he's, he's basically throwing shots at, uh, you know, Stephen King for not being able to make uh, good adaptations of his books. Have you seen any of the movies? Don't get me wrong. Some of them are like iconic, um, but uh, they don't really ever even come close to uh, to Kubrick's um, versions. You know what I mean? Let's get it. Oh, films, they all sink. Oh, and as far as Mr. King goes, I'm a shining man. I made the Justice League look like just a bunch of super slugs. You yep. lost to a hurt. I made the Justice League look like just a bunch of super slugs. You lost to a herd of nerds who call themselves a loser's club. You That's a little pitiful. But yeah, he's right. They call themselves the Losers Club. Just a bunch of super slubs. You lost to a herd of nerds who call themselves the Losers Club. You be gobbled up in Gotham. So stick to your small town. You be gobbled up in Gotham. Uh, so stick to your small town. You'll be gobbled up in Gotham. So, okay, so he's basically saying you really don't, you're really not as good as you think you are. Uh, he himself, in this crime riddled place known as Gotham, right? Uh, he is as powerful as he is, right? And um, while Pennywise uh, is only powerful within a small town, in a sewer, basically, with his big-ass head. To call themselves a loser's club, you be gobbled up in Gotham, so stick to your small town, where you're renowned to see if it's brown, flush it down, clown! That's um that was a part of like a uh, like a water conservation effort that, like years ago maybe a de couple decades ago um, <clears throat> where like it's like uh, if it's yellow let it mellow if it's brown flush it down referring to saving water um, if it's just urine because feces is less uh, is more unsanitary to, to leave uh, floating around yes um, all right so that's what he's saying he's basically saying that Pennywise is shit let's get it. To your small town, where you're renowned to see if it's brown, flush it down, cloud. Are you joking? 
You want to rap? Rap, 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 you're about to fall from a new height. Cause you're, you're a John Doe. That's like a, in my headlight. It's like a deer in the headlights. That's dope. That's a super dope you're setup. You're supposed to be the man who laughs. <laughs> beep, beep. But those jokes were like your new move. <laughs> Mostly really sad. <laughs> you're a John Doe with my deadlights. You're about to fall from... You're, you're John Doe in my deadlights. Headlights. Homophone. <laughs> Mostly really sad. <laughs> you're a John Doe with my deadlights. You're about to fall from a new height. Because you're weak and you've lost your <laughs> good night who wears underwear over his ties. <laughs> Well, that's what he does, and yes, it's awkward. You wear underwear underneath, not, not above. To fall from a new height, cause you're weak and you've lost every fight. Good night, who wears underwear over his ties? <laughs> Hot nightmares and I'm ruthless. His battles like poker, the Joker is useless. When he's not in your car, tell me Arkham Asylum, I'm crazy with bars. Oh. Nicholas and Blade, just... Joker is useless. When he's not in your car, tell me Arkham Asylum, I'm crazy with bars. Jeff Nichols and Blade, just fine. Yeah. But lately, the class is declined. Jared yeah. Leto came out trying to look like he was the cause. He's just not. With the crazy ass colored hair. He did that. Like, everyone hates Takashi, bro. Fine. But Everyone. lately the class is declined. Jared Leto came out trying to look like he was the Kashi 69. So unless you've got a yummy younger brother, I think you'd better run. Because <laughs> I've got 99 red balloons, bitch. And I tell you to take one. None that I have problems, but a bitch ain't one, that's Jay-Z. Um, but also at the same time, yeah, don't take one of his balloons, bro. That man is a weirdo. He'll just drag you into the into the sewer. You may not float. You'd better run, cause I've got 99 red balloons, bitch. But I tell you to take one. Go so back in your well, you giggling sewer ginger. But I tell you to take one. Go back in your well, you giggling sewer ginger. You lost to a turtle and wasn't even a ninja. When I think in a book he did, right? Giggling sewer ginger, <clears throat> you lost to a turtle and wasn't even a ninja. When I flow, I go Mark Ham with ill vigor. Mark Ham, I think that was one. Of, I think it was the voice actor for one of them. I don't remember. I think it was just Joker, maybe. Yeah, it was a Joker. It was a Joker's uh, um, one of the voice actor i think it was like hamel though not ham wasn't even a ninja. when i flow i go mark ham like mark hamel i think i don't know i think so with ill vigor i steal the show like bob kane stole for bill bigger it's absolutely loud every joke of mine stings your three night lights in a cloud beat by the kid from stranger things when i compare your yeah he was part of the loser club your three night lights in a cloud Beat by the kid from Stranger Things When I compare your antics to the fiendish schemes I revel in They pale like the moonlight You can dance with the devil Pale, because he's pale Man. Are you like dance with the... Okay Dice the devil We have so much fun together But no one's dying to play with Joker Except for maybe he's like it What you? R.P. Heath Leather. He, he's okay. Uh, listen, you just messed me up, bro. R.P. Heath Ledger, guys. Um, look at the exact wording here, guys. No one's dying to play with. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where are we at? Where are we at? Hold on. Been together, but no one's dying. No one's dying to play with the Joker. To play with Joker. To play with Joker. Except for maybe he's like it. What you embarrass? That's savage, bro. That's a little. That may be, you know. I don't think it's. Uh, I think it's too soon, guys. I bet mean, you like you beat Harlequin. That purple suit is something you should only see to ah! Oh, shots fired, bro. I wonder if Steve Harvey responded to that, bro. That purple suit is something you should only see Steve Harvey in. Listen, I'm going to say something right now. They're both rapping their ass off, bro. Um, the Joker's killing it. Pennywise is just, I think, more animated. And honestly, I think I like Pennywise a little bit better currently. Uh, just based off of how he's delivering. It's so unique. It's like it's unorthodox. You get what I mean? Um, and while the Joker is sticking with a, a pretty much a standard, like, uh, 
you know, hip-hop delivery. Basically, his aesthetic of hip-hop is uh, pretty pretty uh, mainstream in a sense. Let's get it. Joker. Except for me, he's like it! What? You an embarrassment. I'll be true like you beat Harlequin. That purple suit is something you should only see before you. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I face on your face. I'm the dirty main attraction every 27 years. Yeah. But you know what? I have a secret. It's like a very special toy. If you want to kill a Batman, eat him when he's a boy. Eat him when he's a boy. Oh my god. This brings me back to something that I heard that was absolutely horrific. Um, when referencing the concept of, um, of you know, uh, terror, basically. Um, the saying was, like, you know, this was in, like the early... The early 2000s, like 2001, somewhere around the time of September, you know, right? And um, someone basically said on, on TV or something, yeah, we just need to trim the grass before it grows. Um, hearing that stuck with me till now. I don't think it'll ever leave, right? The concept of, of extinguishing the life of someone young in fear of, of them growing to be something you know, theoretically, right? Rather than not understanding that trimming the grass before it grows just creates, you know, more issues. You get what I mean? You know, I'm trying to stay within the, um, you know, the, the safety, the, the guidelines of YouTube with what I'm saying. You get what I mean? Hopefully you guys are, are reading between the lines, but not the lines of, uh, you know, narcotics uh, that the Joker was referring to earlier. But you get what I mean, hopefully, guys. So, so the whole theory of this, even when he's a boy, it, it just immediately brought me back to that specific uh, um, statement that I heard. It's rough to, to even think of, of doing something like that, but um, that's a bar. It's savage. Very special toy. If you want to kill a Batman, eat him when he's a boy. Don't you lay a finger on my bat, you little freak, or I will spend a whole week knocking out those prickle teeth. Prickle teeth, because he does have the you know shark teeth. <laughs> Tell your mother, for his next gangbang scene, how about a little more PG and a lot less 13? For his next gangbang scene, how about a little more PG and a lot less 13? Even I wouldn't stoop to that kind of impropriety. This is Earth, you space demon. We live in a society. <laughs> movies so i know you don't hurry but because they're long do you down the drain so fast so call you tim scurry tim scurry is referring to tim curry but they're making fun of it like as tim scurry scurry on so i know you don't hurry but i'll sue you down the drain so fast so call you tim scurry ask robin if i drop bars i take smiles and i leave scars guards at arkham will admit that the joker just killed it arkham just ah, killed you stole that from hb lovecraft yep you need scars when you couldn't even escape caesar romero's mustache <laughs> i'm on dresser but i'm making my yeah, the mustache is a little you know rough you couldn't even escape caesar romero's mustache jester i'm on dresser but i'm making my Hold on, guys. Let me I'm go ahead and get that exact wording. Where are we at? Okay. You jester, I'm on Tresser. Uh, about the Mickey my Fortunato. I think, I think this is about Edgar Allan Poe. I think this is something that, because um, I think uh, Edgar Allan Poe wrote a short story. Um, it was the cask of uh, Amontillado, right? Um, the problem is, is that I haven't read that in a really long time. I don't really recall it, but I know the two people, the two uh, uh, groups, basically, within there, um, Montressor and Fortunato. So I know that has that, but I cannot, unfortunately, speak about that topic right now because I don't recall much of it. It's, too, it's been too long. Really, really long, but I know, but I'm pretty sure it is um, in reference to Edgar Allan Poe, though. If you guys could help me explain that bar, this is why I understand it. You guys are legends. Jane, wait, hold on, John Wayne Gacy's. 
I'm I'm the John Wayne of John Wayne Gacy's. Bro's insane. Poster boy for missing present posters. Joker's gonna float with me. Procedures mess with the best ball I got. Procedures are notorious. B I G. <laughs> Walled-eyed. Wall-eyed rapper. Wall-eyed? I think that's out of my vocabulary. Now I know it. I now understand. I now know the word wall-eyed. I have no idea what the hell it means. I will find out, though. I will. I will look this up deeply. Wall-eyed rapper. Um, Biggie had an eye that, that went... A different direction maybe that could that be wall-eyed maybe this is notorious big hope you're disrespecting biggie i'll be disrespecting biggie out here is that what we're doing right now today mm -mm. Mm -mm. don't do this in your life right um wall-eyed rapper so we, I'm, it has to be that most likely right we'll figure it out Insane. poster boy for missing present posters joker's gonna float with me because he just messed with the best wall-eyed rappers it's a notorious big <laughs> All right, let's see where we're going. I would legitimately say mm, Pennywise was the most unique, right? Uh, Joker himself was was really good, but um, as I said, it just it just felt it just felt like a you know a song. You know what I mean? He had the bars though, no complaints. But I think Pennywise took this one. Uh, let me know in the comments who you think took this, guys. I'm um, super interested in hearing that, guys. Uh, and also, let me know in the comments the next one of these um, I should be doing, and I will get into that as soon as I possibly can. Listen, um, you guys all have an amazing day and enjoy it thoroughly. All right?